Hey what's up guys welcome back to another video this is Avery Dasan and here are my 5 top reasons why flagship phones are just better and we are starting right now. First reason why I would recommend you to buy a flagship device over a mid-range phone would be its long-term usability. For those of you who don't know that what it means, this term means that flagship phones can be used for a longer period of time as compared to their mid-range counterparts. And that is because of better equipment use, the better specifications and also the system updates and they really get really good software updates over time and they age very well as compared to the mid-range phones who get only one major update nowadays and if you are an android user this is a must because mid-range phones don't even get any sort of updates in android system and that's pretty cool the second reason why i would recommend you to go and buy a flagship device over a mid-range phone would be because of their really mature features. Now, budget phones come with really, really good features as well. They come with triple camera setup, quad camera setups even, but when you compare them to uh, flagship devices, there is no comparison. Flagship devices are just better. They have mature hardware and software as well. And mid-range devices are just a test which companies do for the customers and they really mature their features out and then they put them into their flagship. Now, for example, the Samsung Galaxy A51 is just launched and it has the rectangular camera cutout at its back and it, it is an indication that Samsung is going to use that in their S11 series and they are testing it in a public version that if public likes it or not and they are then going to release the S11 with the rectangular camera back and they're going to do it even better and mature one. So that is how companies mature their features and they test them in their mid-range phones and then they provide them into their flagship phones. So that is why flagship phones are just more mature in terms of features and usability. My third reason would be flagship phones tend to last a lot longer than their mid-range counterparts. Now, I've always argued that a flagship device will always last longer and will also provide better performance. And why is that? That is because of the better specifications used and the better hardware and software. And that is why flagships tend to use two to three years more than their mid-range counterparts. But as there is always an argument that a mid-range device just costs a three to four hundred dollars and you can always buy another one in terms of price and the flagships are just costing a thousand dollars it has to last longer and that is right flagship tends to last a lot longer because they're really charging you a premium uh, price and they have to last longer because of uh, their really good specifications my fourth argument would be the camera now mid-range phones are coming really really good for example the xiaomi realme no uh, the xiaomi note 10 is having a 180 108 megapixel camera sensor and while numbers aren't everything it still is improving day by day and Xiaomi and Realme phones are getting better and better in terms of camera but they still can be a flagship device just like the iPhone 11 Pro Max, Pixel 4 XL, Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus, they just cannot beat that because of the better post-processing done in the sensors and the software and hardware features of the flagship devices. So they just can't be on the same level. They can be really big in numbers, just like 108 megapixel, but they still cannot beat a 12 megapixel sensor of some other device. So that is why cameras have always been better on flagship device and if you come to video recording it's just no comparison uh, budget phones don't even offer 4k 60 fps for the most part while some of them do they don't really have high bit rate which just causes them to have a soft video and they're really compressed so if you are really looking for a good camera you have to go to the flagship ones because mid-range phones just aren't on the same level and the last but not least my number one concern for my device would be the support so the flagship phones are really better supported at the outlets and by the companies and oems that they have a really really good software and hardware support and they also have really good ip ratings like ip68 and 67 also have dust resistance and they have really really good protection although they are fragile they use really good glass but if you compare their after tech support, the support for a flagship device would be a lot better than a mid-range phone. So these were all the arguments and if you want to see the video of 5 reasons why I would recommend a budget phone over a flagship one, comment down below and I shall be making that one pretty soon. 
This is Arvind Sun, and I'm signing out. Peace out.